Miss Natalie here today. So today, friends, I thought that we could do something special for a special day that's coming up. Do you know what day is coming up that's special? On my calendar. It's to celebrate somebody very special to you that takes care of you. Mommies, it's Mother's Day this Sunday. So today, I thought I could show you a fun craft that you could do with your mom, okay? But before we do, I'm gonna, we're gonna do our calendar and I'm gonna read you guys a story, okay? All right, who's ready to help me count? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Miss Natalie's gonna stick it on right here. Who's ready to find out what day it is? Get your rocket ships ready in five, four, three, two, one. Blast off. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Today is Thursday, today is Thursday. Hooray for today, hooray for today. Today is Thursday, today is Thursday. Hooray for today, hooray for today. Today is Thursday, May 7th. And look, Mother's Day is on Sunday. Let's see how many more days it is until we celebrate our mommies. One, two, three more days, okay? So I thought we would get, we could make her a gift and you can do it with her to make it really fun for her, okay? All right, let's go over what we're learning about one more time too. What is our color? Purple. Do any of your mommies like this color? Oh, maybe it's their favorite, right? What's our letter? O. Letter O. And our shape is a triangle. It is like the tent, right? It is. Okay. So, I have a story. This story is called, Will You Be My Sunshine? And look, it's about a mouse, and the mouse is mommy. Aww. So let's see what it's about. It says it's by writ it's written by Julia Lobo, so she wrote the words, okay? And illustrated by Nicola Slatter. So that means that she drew the pictures for us. Will you be my sunshine? When Miss Natalie reads, how should your bodies be? Eyes watching, ears listen, voice quiet, body calm. This is how we listen, this is how we listen at group time, at group time. All right. Will you be my sunshine on a cold and frosty day? Ooh, burr. What's it doing outside? Snowing. Yes, I will be your sunshine on a cold and frosty day with warm smiles and great big hugs. I'll chase the clouds away. Oh, they're having fun in the snow, aren't they? It's so fun to play with your mom in the snow. What's it doing now outside? It's rainy day. Will you be my rainbow when all seems dull and gray? Yes, I'll be your rainbow when all seems dull and gray. Oh, what are they jumping in? 
puddles, right? That looks fun. And look at the rainbow in the background. After it rains, you can see a rainbow sometimes, can't you? It says, everything will brighten up as we laugh and play together. Oh, what is it outside now? It's dark. Will you be my bright star to show the way back home? Oh no, he doesn't know how to get back home. Do you think his mommy will help him? Oh yes, I will be your bright star to show you the way back home. Oh, and look, what's he doing now? He's sleeping on mommy's shoulder. He's tired. And look, there's their house. There it is. And they have lots of flowers by their house, don't they? And there's the star in the sky. Will you be my moonbeam all at night when it's so dark? Ooh, what's he, oh, what's he doing? He's inside a tent. That's what we were learning about. Is he going camping? Do you think mommy's going camping with him? Yes, I'll be your moonbeam at night when it's so dark. My love for you will shine right through like a brightly glowing spark. Oh, they're camping together. What are, they, what are they doing by that fire? What do they have? Marshmallow and a stick. They're roasting marshmallows. Oh, do you think that he's gonna make a s'mores with his mom? I bet they have some. That looks like fun. And they have a blanket, they're cuddled up. Mm, I love to cuddle with my mommy too, when it's cold outside. Do you? Always makes you feel good, right? I'm so glad you are my sunshine, my rainbow up above. My bright star and moonbeam, my sweet and precious love. Oh, now we made mommy a picture. And it says, I love you. And look at all those pictures, too. That is so sweet. The end. Did you guys like that story? I liked it a lot. I thought it would be a good one to read to you guys. Um, so, I was thinking that you could do a craft. And I think that everybody should have one of these. This is a tin can. You know when you have green beans or corn or any kind of something in a can like that? Well, if you can save one, that would be great, okay? Because you can do so many things with this. I was thinking that we could paint it. So you gotta get something real old on, okay? Because you're gonna need acrylic paint, okay? Moms and dads, acrylic paint for this. So it stays on, it stays good, okay? But you can paint it however you want. And then your moms and dad, your moms can use it. It's for moms for Mother's Day, right? Your mom can use it as a vase, maybe? Ooh, that would be pretty with flowers. These are some fake flowers that Miss Stanley has. Maybe you have some at your house. Or she could put her pens and pencils in here. Okay? So get on a you have to be on the table, but you gotta make sure you um don't get don't get paint everywhere, okay? Gotta be really careful with it too. But you can paint your jar. So Miss Natalie is going to show you. Look. So I'm just painting my jar. I'm using a light pink for it. I think that would be really pretty. And I think my mom will like this. Do you guys think my mom will like it? I think she will. So Miss Natalie's going back and forth, back and forth, right? So you can, 
if you want, you can use lots and lots of different colors. You can use just one color, whatever you think, okay? And then um, if you also want to use some stickers, you could put some, um, some letter stickers on before you paint. So you'd stick them on if you want to spell mom out or something, and then you paint over it. Then when the can is dry, all dry from the paint, then you can peel the stickers off and it'll say mom on it. Or you can say, I love mom, okay? Um, there's some examples on Miss Natalie's website for you guys to, uh, to look at, okay? To get some ideas. But I bet they're gonna turn out great and your moms are gonna love it. Happy Mother's Day to all the moms out there. <laughs> Bye, friends.